it's not over for even the ones that uh, are, uh, won't make our roster. It's not over. I can't tell you uh, the numbers. of. It has to be 100 or more uh, during the time I've been with the Cowboys that uh, got cut at this time and turned around and right back in there helping us win games with the Cowboys. So uh, uh, this isn't, uh, the, doesn't have the finality that you might think, and that'll be the uh, thing that I want to be sure and emphasize. Had a lot of guys give us a lot in camp. Jerry, with what you've seen from Trey Lance, what's your evaluation of his future with this team? Well, I saw good, and I saw some things that you'd like to have back. I hate it. Those uh, five intercepts are going to be a stat on a game that uh, uh, I couldn't have asked for more reps and better situation to watch him play, and and, uh, uh, he needed that because the one thing he's missing more than anything is the lack of reps, much less NFL reps. Uh, saw some good things and saw some things you'd like to have back. But uh, overall, uh, I'm glad to have that uh, outing with us. And certainly, uh, uh, we're planning on him being on our roster for sure. What have you seen from him that tells you he could be a starter for you someday in this league? Well, I think he's a, uh, his athleticism. Uh, I think uh, the main thing is the improvement from over the last uh, six weeks. That's impressive. Very impressive. Uh, what you're looking for is... Uh, Uh, Is there going up and is going up uh, dramatically, really, every practice and every game? So I'm going to use that word because uh, he's doing um, a lot of things that he wasn't doing as well early that he's doing well now. Uh, I think we added up the other day, he hadn't had but about 1,000 plays in his career uh, since uh, about 2015 or uh, or his year that he played uh, there in North Dakota. So, bottom line is, uh, there was some good and bad out there for him tonight. You're coming up on a year since that trade. Do you regret about making that trade for him? For a fourth round pick? Are you kidding me? <laughs> <laughs> Although we did get Dak. Enough. We did get Dak with our second fourth round pick. <laughs> so you got a point there. But we've had some that didn't play in the fourth round too. Jerry, uh, do you look at the how do you look at the cornerback position? Are you gonna look outside the organization for help there? For what? The cornerback position. Not at all. Not in any way. No. Not at all. We've got. Uh, that's the good news is that we've got some guys that have really uh, shown well in camp. We won't be looking at all. What do you like about Carson? I like the fact that he's uh, playing at the level he is for how long a time, which is not much in the NFL. And he certainly is going to get a great opportunity to fill in here. We've had a couple of guys come in here and do pretty well the last three or four years at uh, rookie cornerback, so maybe he'll make all pro. Jerry, near the season starting, any updates on we're not, uh, I don't have any updates, but uh, we are near the season start. Have you seen him or his representation? Listen, I've got a lot forward. of things to talk about. I'm only talking about who's here. Jerry, now that preseason has come to an end, everything you see in training camp in these three games, how do you feel like this team is ready for 2024? I really like the way that our young players, uh, several of them, at, different, posi- at uh, uh, different areas of the team, both sides of the ball, that probably should have played more last year. And uh, we just had uh, uh, veterans that were uh, getting that play time. Now then, we've got those guys that are now coming in here, and I really like the camp that they had. You add those to the fact that we're getting some rookies that uh, probably are uh, ahead of what our expectations could have been. And so we've really done what you have to do in this league, and that is bring young players on and use them and play them, and that's what we're doing. That was the plan. That is the plan. Jerry, what did you think of Deuce Vaughn's preseason and what he, his chances of making this roster? He obviously has got some very special uh, talent, uh, and uh, you've got to find a place for that. Uh, you've got to find a place for it on Sunday to get it on the field. And uh, you need a, uh, uh, that's, that'll be the job of the next few days of weighing what a roster spot means. And he's sitting right there, though. He certainly uh, uh, he is uh, gadget juice. And uh, at non-gadget times, mm-hmm. and so uh, I really—he's uh, well, going to be interesting for us.